Hello, friends, everyone. Uh, thank you for joining again tonight. I am calling a little bit of an audible tonight uh, because it's been a bit of a hectic couple weeks. <clears throat> so, instead of the usual either music discovery or improv music tonight, we're going to do what I talked about most of October doing on a different night, but we're doing it tonight instead, which is just playing games. So tonight I'm going to play Iron Lung uh, first, and then hopefully Paratopic. These games are supposed to both be about an hour to play, so um, we should be able to fit them both in tonight. We'll see how it goes, but that's the plan. Um... Got coffee again. I'll say it, I always say it, but uh, you know, this is an off week, this is a different week, but for the uh, future old games, new music streams, I am always out there looking for music. So if you're an artist, if you make music, I'd love to hear it. Um, there's a Link down below in the Twitch. There is also on the link tree um, a contact form. And if you want to just send me uh, anywhere that it can be streamed, uh, your music, I'd love to give it a listen and see if I can find a slot for it on a future stream. Um, but tonight we're just going to enjoy some games. Both of these are indie, uh, experimental, for the most part, as far as I'm aware. Um, Iron Lung is about essentially piloting a submersible on an alien planet, I think. Paratopic, I don't, I don't even really know. I don't really know what the premise is there. We're just going to find out together. Um, so, without any more chat why don't we just get into it We've got iron lung up here and we're gonna start off with that I think I'm gonna turn this audio down just a bit okay hopefully this will work all right so let's start a new uh, all right it says decades ago every known star and habit habitable planet vanished leaving only those who were on space stations or starships this event became known as the quiet rapture with supplies dwindling and infrastructure crumbling survivors are searching for any trace of natural resources in a universe of barren moons lit by the ghost light of vanished stars one such moon holds a strange anomaly, an ocean of blood. You are a convict tasked with exploring this anomaly in a makeshift submarine nicknamed the Iron Lung. It was not designed for this depth, so you will be welded inside and the forward window will be closed. There was no time for training. If successful, you earn your freedom. The stakes are high. I think it's die or earn freedom. Uh... I don't think there's any way, other way out of this iron lung if we're being welded in. Beginning at oh, so I'm trying out some new lighting, Cruising depth in roughly 40 seconds. which you may Stand notice. Um, got some um, blue and pink. Some voltage irregularities in the instruments, so keep an eye out for sparks or flames or anything like that. Approaching maximum depth. Uh, the hole's feeling it, but it's still holding strong. Closing port hole shielding. All right, we are now locked in. We're starting to lose radio signal. You'll be at cruise depth soon, so resisting and be careful. You're on your own. Good. Great. We've got a map. We've got a 
briefing. Your task is to photograph these points of interest with the SM-13's forward camera. Photos must be taken within two units of the specified position and 10 degrees of the specified angle. Okay, we have to use the map because can't navigate by sight. Proximity indicators. All right, we are in a very little... Maybe I shouldn't go pushing buttons randomly. Is this my camera? This must be my camera. Over, okay. Okay, so I take it we got to make our way to these coordinates and then. Where are we at? 182, 116. What's closest? 180, 576. So we might actually be closer to this one. I think I'll go over to this one first. 322, 186, and 33 angle. Point oh one percent off is not percent degrees off. It's okay. All right, I already forgot where we're going. Uh, three twenty two and one eighty six. things. Okay, I think I have to steer this way, so we're going to try to... Well, we, uh, we fucked that up real quick. Try that again. Don't careen into whatever I careened into is the lesson. Beginning at descent. Be more careful with the uh, proximity there. Cruising depth in roughly 40 seconds. Stand by. Um, I'm seeing some voltage irregularities in the instruments, so keep an eye out for sparks or flames or anything like that. I missed that part the first time around. I'm not looking forward to having Approaching sparks or flames. Uh, the hole's feeling it, but it's still holding strong. Closing porthole shielding. We're starting to lose radio signal. You'll be at cruise depth soon, so risk thing and be careful. You're on your own. All right, let's try to not die this time. Oops. Okay, we're still going to 
go that way. So good, I'm past 186. I mean, if we assume that these are like tunnels, then I guess I'm working my way around here, so that's good. Getting this number so quickly. Oh, we got something over there now. Okay, good. this is going to be, but let's see what terrifying sights we see, yeah? Okay. Nice. Okay, that counted. Uh, 378, 263. I think we can head up this way. Like that sound. Three seventy eight, two sixty three. Okay, there's something over there. I don't know if it's the wall or whatever is making that noise. Either way, I don't want to run into it. Three seventy eight, two sixty three. Okay, we're closing in.
263. I don't know what that's going to be. I mean, it probably will, right? Let's try this. Oops. There. Should be close enough. Okay, what do we have in store for us now? More? I don't know, my gut says bones, but I have no idea what that is. It's an alien blood moon, not blood moon, alien blood ocean, so uh... Okay, okay now let's head up to... 259-406 by heading that way. either. Oxygen's going down. We better get at this. I got a lot of places to be. 259-406. I have a terrible memory. 259-406. <laughs> I got a good bit of the uh, thalassophobia myself, so these sounds are freaking me the fuck out. test out if it's going to let me get away with 406 and a half, 296. Oh god, I don't like that. No, no alien blood whales, please. Um, don't like that either. Do we think those are tentacles? Okay, it gave me that one. Um, do I go all the way around, or do I backtrack? Let's go around.
imagine I'm coming right around this curve, so just operating on that theory. Oh, 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 there's something right in front of me. Something that moved, I think. Okay, good. Oh, God. Yeah, I gotta get all the way around here and then down to... 560, 77. Okay, so I think I was pulling away from the wall. Yeah. I think that backs up my theory. I was looking at the wrong axis. Uh, okay, so I need to get through here at about 325. Let's try to not clip this wall. Oh, 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 oh boy, oh boy. I'm really close to something. I need to do something about that or just hurry. Okay, so I should be right about here. I need to head to 560, 277. again. Oh god. No, 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 no. Okay. What did I say? 277. Okay, we went a little down. Let's go.
277 and I forgot what the other one was, 560. said 47 43 okay that's less intimidating than the last one of course this looks a little ominous this uh it looks like a giant mouth. Maybe I'm making something out of nothing, but I should get moving anyway. Okay, we got that one done. 613, 197. Got a leaking pipe. Don't know what to do about that. So. Didn't like that. And it made me lose track of what I was doing. 197, 613. As far as I'm aware, we're the only machine in this ocean. Which means those are alien blood whales. At least that's what I'm calling them. Okay, let's go straight down. Oh, I'm done. 197. I mean, the achievement just said not a whale, but I'm going to continue to call it an alien blood whale. But, uh, no thank you. Don't want to run into one. Oh god, okay. Oh, okay. This one's going to be tough to navigate. So I'm down here. So I need to thread the needle over here at what, 275-ish? Two seventy-five and seven Thank 
you. Around to 864, 258, 864, Other creepy noises that I don't know what they are. 864. Okay. That is, but I'm getting the hell out of here. Okay, I gotta thread that needle again back to 275. Seventy 
98. Okay, I'm still in here, so I got limited choices. Another leaky pipe. Good news. Good news. Uh, somehow, okay, so I gotta come up through, what is that, 575 ish? Five, 550 to 5. Gotta watch out for that, and then I can head straight up. Oxygen's okay. I have a long way to go. Uh, we just got hit by something, I believe. Don't like that. What will this do? Nothing. right about here. Okay, so let's get up to the 500s and then head back east. everyone's Halloweens. Halloween was good. I don't know why I pluralized Halloween, but I hope everyone's Halloween was good. We always get a lot of trick-or-treaters. Closing in. Um, 
I'm going to wager a guess that I can get through here. If I can't, then I don't know what to do, but that's going to be my how I'm going to start, so I'm going to head back west. Get to about 375. I think I'm at the right, yeah. I got three more stops. I think that's making good pace with the oxygen. And I'm almost to where I need to head north. Twenty-five, seven forty-one. Uh oh, okay, now I'm a little blind because the map. Seven forty one and three twenty five K. Jesus, there's a fire. Oh, boy. Um, hello. Whew, at least I have a fire extinguisher. Okay. Back to this. Where was I? Trying to get to 720. Sorry, 740, 320.
41, is that what I said? And 18. Why'd I go that way? Okay, now my concern is going to be... Well, I guess I'll go down this way and then head back, because that's going to be a nightmare. Okay. 200 and then I gotta head back south.
176, 180, and 184. to this picture. Okay. Back out. Get away. Oh. I think we got hit again. up to 650 spin it around head this way all right I got one more level of oxygen to go and one one more site. So let's. Yeah, we basically got to stay between 650 and 700 and just book it over there. Hopefully. Entirely sure what I'm up against here. Okay, let's back. I'm really close to something and I don't know what it is. away from it. But I'm like right here, so I'm going to have a problem with this wall. I feel like I'm being followed. get around this thing.
that's the wall. Jesus, yep, I am being Oh god, I shouldn't have taken a picture of it. I got real mad at that. Jesus. Oh, I gave me a heart attack. <sighs> okay, we died. We died. But we can continue. I don't know where it's gonna put us, but I... Okay, I don't know, that was, I don't, I don't know what that was. Didn't like it. Didn't like it. 425. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna run into the exact same creature. Okay, how the hell do I get around it? Maybe without taking a picture. I did not like that. Nope. Please stop following me, Mr. Monster. Oh god, I did it again. I think I hit the wall or it got me. One of the two. Makes me jump every time. Lowest I can go is like six seventy five. I don't think I'm going to be able to miss this creature entirely, so I just got to work my way over. Yep, there it is. Am I doing this? Is there a different path I should be taking? Unless the answer is to go down here, go over, and then... I am gonna try again to just thread this tunnel, even though this monster doesn't want to let me through. Bastard. Okay. Doesn't he know I'm almost done with my task? Mr. Giant Sea Creature, please let me pass. get 
too close to the wall. I got an idea. Let's see if it'll follow us back and then I can go around when I've got more space. Staying pretty stubbornly on that one side of me. What if I just charge it? By that I mean chase the sea monster. That seems like a smart idea, right? <laughs> no, it's not smart, but I'm going to try it. Because I need to get through this uh, tunnel. Okay. Mr. Giant squid or blood octopus or blood whale or blood megalodon. Oh, I don't want to jinx it. I think it's flooding in here. Where did I say I was going? 675, 
else there. Oh, don't be a sea monster. Leave me alone. And we're about to drown in blood water. Seventy-five. Head straight north. Come on, let's do it. Outside the door. Uh, 295. Okay. Oh, Jesus! You got me. You got me. Hey, we finished. Well, that was fun and uh, very tense and we ended up dead uh, I'm sorry my monitors being weird okay the expedition ultimately raised more questions than answers. Satellite images showed pieces of the SM-13 scattered all over the bottom of the trench, as though it had been torn apart by some huge beast. The wreckage cannot be reached at this time. No photographs have been recovered. Stars shine pale as bones. The moon is a lifeless corpse. It's ocean, a gaping wound. The universe... I missed the last part. All right. We did it. We iron lung jump back over here while I get um, paratopic up and running making good time it's 810 so we should also have time for paratopic All right. Okay, there we go. Has no save feature and must be completed in a single. Oh, I have an enemy. You're the I got a call about you. Undeclared goods, they said. I don't know what you're talking about. Who said? Yeah, who said? Your enemy. Why are you calling me friendo? People come through here, you show us the forms and everything is fine. But you didn't know. Why is that? <laughs> if that were true, then why did a concerned citizen leave us a tip about your cargo? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> That's the case. I'm afraid they're going to take you to processing. Okay, now I want more. Oh, I, I don't get away. That's good to know.
I supposed to get up? I'm not aware of how to get up, so I think I'll just sit here. Well. Can you handle it? I don't know. I'm the Meanwhile, these birds are just outside eating a dude, I think. So that's fun. Gun. Bullets. Camera. Can I have the camera? Reload. That's how we do it. Okay. He's gonna rule the you saw what happened last time. Be professional. Okay. Uh-huh. Don't play stupid. Uh oh. Um I'm sorry. Okay. We're way too close to this guy's face. Whatever you do, don't watch them. We'll know if you do. Oh, don't watch the tapes. I assume. Okay. I have a gun. All the people left. I shouldn't go back there. says no humans allowed. Oh. Yep. Yeah. Okay. I uh, folded that. Well, hello, Gagsherdurf. Um, yeah, I've been jump scared 
several times tonight in Iron Lung. Uh, I just got started with Paratopic. Wedding festivities, eh? That sounds fun. Not as fun as the spooky zone. I mean, unless you're the one getting married. Then I'll give you a pass. But I know that's not the case. <laughs> Good. I'm glad, I'm glad you like the spooky zone. Um... We're waiting for a very slow elevator. I don't want to get on, but I know I'm supposed to. Some men were here earlier, got into their apartment. Yeah, I know, they stole some tapes or something. Mind keeping it between us? Gotta do a favor. What? What is this light? Is this the smoke? I don't get it. Uh, okay. It is a team, isn't it? Something? Need another one. You're starving. Do you need tapes? Watch the one I copied last time. Yeah. Why is she saying she's hungry? For tastes. Hmm. The guy in the diner said. Well, I don't remember what he said, but it was a threat. I. <laughs> I think. I I don't understand the hunger, and tapes. Thing. Um, also, I think I'm less scared of this person than the person in the diner. They found out last time. If she's there, one who lived in your old SSDDS. Can I ask if she... I'm sorry, I'm not understanding that comment. <laughs> when I lost all the movies? All the tapes? Uh oh Oh, I'm driving. I think she... Well, apparently I gave her a tape, and then they found out, whoever they are, in the diner... I denied her another one. Uh, 
Oh. Don't play with the radio while you're driving, kids. So you run into the... It's Carl or Raquel. So, Aiden, I call a feeding pool. Tell the cool small. I'm driving just as badly when I'm... Yeah, the aesthetic is awesome. I, I really like this. Yeah. Oh, oh, there's a gun. Wow, I gotta pay attention to where I'm We'll just listen to this weird talk radio. Yeah. Well, we're not. We're not. It's not fun. It's not fun. And still clover and calm. And the sky is awfully green to me. I'm tired of the talk. Even though it's gibberish. Let's listen to some good elevator music. The gun? Oh boy. I didn't even notice that. That is a good question. It probably <laughs> fell down below the seat one of the times that I ran into the wall like just now. Oh. Why is there a whole case there now? I guess I should drive. It's a good thing this car is... <laughs> I think this is a bumper car. Must be. Yeah, it's good enough. I'm just gonna keep bouncing back and forth. Well, that was abrupt. I'll take some Cheetos, please. Or some, um, salt and vinegar, probably. Or this, uh, bag of, um, Funyuns. That's probably what this stuff is. Dog food, yeah. Or dishwash soap. Dish soap. Or so. More Funyuns? Okay. I can go with you. Hard caramels? Are they? Yes, so mm, Funyuns. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've had Funyuns. I don't know why that came to mind, but now they kind of sound good. You got any of that lowland milk? Where's the nearest place to eat before the border? I need something to keep me awake. Twelve Hour Spitfire, Beasley Bub, and Auntie M's Old Remedy. <laughs> I have no idea. The uh, dialogue options are limited and weird. Auntie M's. She makes it over in Rio Laredo. Local stuff, then. Family, too. No kidding. This won't give me a heart attack or anything, will it? Strawberry, gooseberry, blackberry. Uh, let's, let's be adventurous and go with gooseberry. Vending machine is over there. This one?
Okay, I'm gonna take it. That means a little box of uh, instant noodles. Wait, what? Kill this man. <laughs> yeah, why didn't I... I put it... Excuse me, sir. I put in a coin. I distinctly heard it. And I have no... Auntie M's gooseberry... Um, something. Burger Bills. Close to the border, you've got more places. What do you like? Where's Burger Bills? Big purple sign gave Frank a seizure one time. Who's Frank? Down the street here? What are you reading? Eric wrote a book about how aliens are better than us. Okay. Yeah. Hang on, hang on, hang on. You. Since when do you get to introduce the premise that aliens are better than us and then say that it's because aliens travel between planets? That's a leap. Wouldn't the same be true if aliens didn't exist? You oh yeah? Did they probe you? It's so old, Don't question Eric, sir. Eric is infallible. Very funny. That's a false flag operation perpetrated by people who are trying to cover up the existence of aliens. Okay, I've lost interest in talking to this guy. Fix your vending machine. What if the aliens are trying to hide? Let's just troll him for a little bit. That's dishonest. He also knows that the aliens are honest. And they're traveling between planets. And they're better than us. I see. Actually, I might be passing through late on my way back. Any place good to stay. It's so cool. Super 16 burned down a while ago. There's the Mesquite and the Ranchero. They're both down the highway a couple miles. Big signposts, ordinary chains, nothing special. Bummer, that was my usual stop. Maybe my last visit was the reason it burned it down. So why'd you ask what was good around here? Never tried to stop anywhere else. You enjoyed it while it lasted. <laughs> Gonna meet some friends for some buggy driving. I hear that. Well, time for me. Finally, this is this is not a guy we should have continued to carry on the conversation with. Ooh. Okay. Hmm. Take some pictures of the view. Kind of going to assume I'm supposed to go down this place. We really <laughs> flushed out alien guy with broken vending machine. <laughs> that was the most character development yet, was the uh, convenience store clerk. Did I just teleport? What the hell? Beautiful. Snap some pictures. Wasn't I supposed to be heading over the border, though? Can I just... Yep. Hmm. Suspicious. 
delicious little building. Can I just cross this river? Okay. Yep. Okay, let's go see what this building has to offer. Oh, hey, look. The camera did something. Oh, what do you know? We're filling up the uh, little... dots, I guess. I think I... Oh, I can get in. a mattress or a hay? No, that's a mattress. Oh. I'm just gonna keep knocking on this door until someone lets me in. Okay. Back out. Let's go. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Um, well, here goes nothing. Went from taking pictures of birds to going down into a bunker. This would not be a smart decision. Find a random house in the forest when the door opens creepily, walk right in. These are all bad decisions. This thing looks fun, though. Not really, I have no idea what it is. And then, <laughs> obviously, when you see a hole in the ground, I'm down. Oh, I don't think it's going to let me. Damn. I, they are great. They are great ideas. Thank you. That is how we get ourselves killed in this game. I really want to climb down this. I'm really mad it's not letting me. There's a lot. It goes down a few rungs. We just drop the rest of the way, right? This is like a really crazy bunker here. I don't know what I just took a picture of, but it wanted me to, so. Oh, look, the sky. Okay. Back to taking pictures of birds. Let's make this game more like Alba's wildlife adventure or whatever that's called. I see you, bird. I'm not entirely sure why I'm doing any of the things that I'm doing. Up through this bush. Jump down into the water. 
water. Come on, one more bird. Right, get back here. Damn it. Follow the river. Windmill looks fun. And there's a path down. dots. That probably means something. I'm back on the road. I didn't even get to find out where that windy uh, cliff road led. Yeah, <laughs> the transitions are startling. Also, I'm very concerned about the color of the sky. This does not look healthy. I don't know if I'm actually supposed to like be looking out for billboards. I can't open the case, unfortunately. Otherwise, I would be pulling the gun out. Just to shoot out the window for fun. Actually, that's probably the case of tapes that I'm uh, taking past the border. I don't know why, but I'm driving and this case is here and I just want to like fire out the window because it seems like what should be happening right now. I'm a really bad driver in this game. Good thing there's no one else on the road. Music's getting spookier. She's going from phone call and going around. Yeah, it's the wall. Oh, yeah, around. Hey, I'll. <laughs> I love the uh, aesthetic. And the art style is very intriguing. The most startling part of this game is the transitions. Because I'm driving one minute and then I'm chasing birds with a camera again. Whatever, I'm going to count it. I got that bird. 
Wait, where the hell am I now? That's a security camera, right? This is a weird place for a security camera. Okay, I can't go that way. I am not sure if this is the right way. Nope. And I can't go into the river, so... Back this way. I think I just heard... I'm hearing growling. Don't like that. The music's really good in this game, too. Surely this track's abandoned. I'm not going to get hit by a train. Right? Get off the tracks just in case. Okay, there's no just in case. There's no way to get a train on those tracks. Oh, I didn't notice that. We are kind of following the color of bird. Famous last words, I said that. Oh, maybe I do have to. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Let's follow the colored bird. You better be right about this. Okay, I should've. fast as I can. The, pre <laughs> the pressure. <laughs> I, so far this is pretty promising. I probably would have run into a dead end had I kept going down the river. Or up the river. river. And now I lost track of the bird. I'm gonna assume this way. This looks like a airport, a crumbling airport, perhaps. Well, that came out of nowhere. There was a... Did you see a man in that, like, standing in that thing? That's where I was headed. Until I got ambushed. Oh, the gun's back. And the suitcase is not. That's what I thought. I definitely thought I saw a dude standing there. <laughs> Maybe Eric was right. Maybe the aliens are better than us. Maybe they're here. Maybe they keep teleporting me back and forth between my car and the river. At the... 
Why does... Okay, I don't understand. The gun disappeared again, and the case is there. Designs in this, uh, wherever we are, are a little strange. Obviously, everything else is totally normal. Now, the, the case is gone, too. Great. Lost everything. Oh, the gun's back. Every time I hit the roof. I don't... I have no idea what triggers this, uh... Maybe he was right, though. Can I bring these chips up with me? No. The vending machine still hasn't given me my money back. I can go with you. I'm on my own. Yeah, what makes you say that? Why do you think I'm not from around here? Did I just jump back into the conversation? <laughs> this asshole doesn't give us more Eric info. That's going to be the one topic we can't breach. He's going to be talking about burgers. I haven't lived here in a long time. Uh, family stuff. Appreciated. What local attractions? A giant ball of twine. Sorry, I'm not really that interested. <laughs> it's a lie if I say I'm not interested. That's fun. Sure, I've been known to enjoy a giant, a giant ball of twine or two in my time. What else you got? Oh, the milk store. Okay, the ghost carnival has my attention. <laughs> the fact is a lie. <laughs> uh, the kids say it's haunted. Okay, let's ask about the milk store. Milk, milk products, and milk accessories. Yeah, please tell me what a milk accessory is. Oh, milk bottles, milking pails. If you need to milk a cow, then, uh, go to the milk store to get a... You work... You work, Oh, that's right, you do work at the milk store. I already know about the ghost carnival. Oh, 
The electrical company. The museum is random crap from the electrical company? I'm I'm I have a lot of questions. What museum is like, yeah, you found this random shit in the woods? Cool. We'll put it in the museum. Does that sound like a normal museum to you? You Well, time for me to get going. You didn't want to talk about Eric. He keeps referring to my friend, but I just said I uh I'm traveling alone. Silverton, did they shut down? When the electric uh, elect, uh, electricity goes off? I confused myself with that question. <laughs> You two drive safe now. Oh, um, yeah, keep backing up. The old just <laughs> stuff you find in the woods. Put it in a museum. I can see it. I can see it. Look, if you got a small town museum, you're gonna be looking for things to put it in. Um, forgive me. Oh. That was far more brutal than I anticipated. Okay, let's uh, stick a tape in the tape. Uh, PCR. It's gonna make me relive that every time. I believe it is a Magnum Extra Strength. Probably very obvious. Oh, Jesus. I think the cop liked that I shot him. Just a guess. Oh, hey. At least now I'm armed when I... Round two, Eric. I'm coming. This is as fast as I can run. Oh, what the? There's no more man standing there. Just, uh... Damn it, I came prepared. Oh, there is not a man standing there. There's a man impaled on... What the hell am I looking at? That's not a man. Kind of is. I have no idea what I'm looking at. Is that... It might be old me. Highway 69. Did he beat? Now, you can help off. That's good. Uh, get your dream. I'll wrap my one out of my baby. Well, what was that? What was your name? Ma'am? Ma'am? Ma'am?
okay, I think. And that was the end. A little confused by that. I don't know that I entirely understand it, but it was fine. <laughs> we have no resolution. There's someone impaled on a spike. Um, I shot the cop and then he turned into a TV. That's what I got. That's what I got. That's all I got. The sound design was good in that. The uh, uh, weird dialogue. That was interesting. I did shoot the cop in half. <laughs> yes. It was a far more powerful revolver than I expected. Megan Fox. I don't think it's... Oh, David Zemanski. David Zemanski's the one who uh, made Iron Lung. Yeah, Iron Lung was uh, great. Creep me the hell out. <laughs> the sound, because it's essentially like using a map and following coordinates because you're you're blind. Like you can't, you don't have any windows, so you can't see the ocean around you. Um, you just have like proximity sensors. But then there's sounds of things in this alien ocean. So yeah, it was a lot of fun. Um, scared me quite a few times <laughs> all right all the achievements that must mean that there are different paths in this game yeah it was a good uh, it was a good game I recommend watching it or giving it a shot um, and this was interesting I'm I don't get it. But from the looks of this, I'm kind of guessing there's maybe some branching paths uh, maybe that link some of the things together. All right. Um, cool. Well, that, that does it. We finished two games tonight. Um, if you gave that lady tapes or talk, yeah, maybe if I talked more about Eric, yeah, here I was just wanting to get off the topic of Eric and Eric was probably <laughs> the one to shed some light on the whole thing. Eric was the one person that knew what he was talking about in that game and the cop, but. I shot the cop. You can probably choose to not shoot the cop. That's probably another one of the things. Uh, just put a tape in. Don't know what that would do. Eric probably is the key. Yeah. Yeah, I think you're right about that. Um, cool. Well, that was fun. Uh, that will do it for tonight. Um, and that's, that's going to be the end of my horror season stuff uh, specific. We'll get back to um, old games, new music. Uh, from time to time I might do this if I have a uh, you know get behind or have a crazy week or whatever just uh, play some games. But we are keeping the um, both the old games, new music with the uh, music discovery and then also the improv music. Um, so we'll keep those. I'll keep those going. Uh, so next week, uh, I'm going to get another 
bunch of music together that we can all listen to and don't know what game I'm going to play yet. I'll figure that out. But we're moving into the... Well, we're past Halloween and we're moving into the rest of the holiday season here, so... I probably have to play some holiday-themed stuff once we get closer. Um, but yeah, I think that will do it for tonight. So if you were hanging out here, I appreciate you. Uh, if you were watching it on the VOD on Twitch, I appreciate you. And if you're watching it on the YouTube, I appreciate you. Um, if you are also on the YouTube, if you want to leave a comment, that helps out as well. Um, Gagster, thank you. And uh, you have a great night as well. As well as everyone, I appreciate you hanging out. That'll do it for tonight, and uh, I don't think I have anything else, except if you make music, send it to me. Link in the Twitch and in the link tree uh, to the contact form. Other than that, I think that'll do it, and I hope you all have a great night.